All right, what's happening, y'all? We back. The pizza guys is Brandon, Mike. Yeah, we back. We uh, been a hot minute. Hot minute. We kind of rusty, so this episode is going. We gonna call it the rust, the rusty scupper. Yeah, nah, this, we ain't gonna this call the it the rusty that. bucket right here. Uh, we uh, bucketing it up. We, <laughs> we definitely rusty. But we back. Yes. New review. New spot. Yes. Yes. Tell where we, where go we to. at? We went to, Ma what's it called? Matthews. Matthews. Man, see, I messed it up. I was Matthews about to call it Michael. Eastern Avenue and Patterson Park. Um, nice little jump up. What we get? A 10 inch pizza? 10 inch pizza. It was pretty. pretty uh, what was the price on that 10 inch pizza? Pizza was 13 bucks. So I'm going to grab the camera. Might get a little distorted for a second. Yeah, show y'all the pizza. It looks, what we it working looks with. interesting. I'm it's gonna looks, say it that. looks, it kind of got the Chicago feel, it looks like to me. Yeah. Um, deep gonna, dish. Yeah, uh, looks, looks pretty see. good. We're going to see. So we're gonna flip this around really quick. Let me flip that around. New camera box over here. Oh, there we go. Nice looking pizza. What we pay for that pizza? Thirteen bucks. Thirteen dollars for this pizza. Honestly, I uh, it don't look too appetizing to me, but um, we gonna see what it tastes like. And Put that camera that's back the key. up there. What it. what does it taste like? It's just greasy. So it's just the. It is. It's very greasy. Oh, I wish very, I could show you guys. You can get over here a little bit. Very, very greasy. But see, most people like that. That's just, uh, you know that? They can't see it. That but. cheese is is got to be divine then. Uh, Let's go. I'll take so, a little piece. So go ahead, grab the slice. Little, little guy right I'm going to talk to him for a minute. To me, based on the appearance, I'm I'm not digging it. I'm not digging it. You got a knife Ain't no knife. You get no napkins? No. Nah, nope. I sure didn't. I ain't got, I got plate. <sighs> I got plates. There they go. Oh, yeah. There they go. There plates go. and napkins. I got them. They gave them to me. Good. Good service. They were really nice, nice ladies working the front. Right. Really nice ladies. Let me get one of them plates. Right. Oh, man. All right. What you thinking, okay. Mike? I, like. <laughs> so, I'm with Brandon. The look is not very appealing. I'm, I'm. I guess this grease just sitting on top of it. You know, just, you burn my not, cheese on top a little bit. I, I mean, like that though. Maybe that's the style. I mean, I don't, I don't know. Um, See, now we in the sunlight. It's kind of flops pretty nice. It's kind of messing it up. There we go. I mean, the flops pretty nice. The flops not bad at all. The camera's too far you know, um, This isn't gonna work. I don't know. I'm gonna let you know right now. Yeah, taste that. One bite kind of took your whole slice, right? Or was it all your cheese? Mm-hmm. All your cheese. Crazy. But is it tasty? All right. It smells like a DiGiorno. It tastes like a... Don't say it tastes like a DiGiorno. I'm going to be upset. Not for 13 bucks. It mm -hmm. tastes like a, like a Chicago pizza, bro. It tastes like a deep dish? Oh, I don't like the deep dish. Mm. Maybe that's just my bias. I'm not a deep dish fan. Let me, um... It's good, though. Let me say this. Go ahead and talk your shit. The character, the texture, at first threw me off. Okay, because it looks like it needs this pizza. It really does. It is. It tastes like a little pan pizza. Yeah, but deep dish usually has a lot more sauce. Right? The dough is good. It's got a good taste. Good little crunch as you're eating it. Okay. The sauce is... The sauce is average. Thirteen dollars. Thirteen dollars. Mm, I've had better pizza for thirteen dollars. Um, way better pizza, but that's not the point. What's your grade? I'm not giving too much silence. Everybody knows the rules. We do a one through 10, and that's based off of sauce, cheeses, ambiance, the way they take care of us in there, their service. My man said it was good service, good atmosphere. It's a nice looking place. It's like a restaurant. I'm gonna there. give the pizza a, a 5.5. Mm -hmm. it's, it's a good, it's, it's solid. My type of pizza, no. That's not a solid pizza. No, it's not my type of pizza. It, it, I mean. To somebody else, this might be a seven or eight. If it's their style pizza. 
Um, Mike. Mike, that's why I use my mans, y'all. That's why I use my mans, though. Because this is not, first off, I'm not even going to get into the, the $13 price tag. That's fine. You know, good things, good things cost. You know? But this here is, it reminds me, um, it's, it's, it's not quite a deep dish, but it was made in like a pan. It's like this a pan like pizza. A slice of cake with cheese on it. You think? No, I think this is like, I don't, now some people might crucify me on the internet for this, but I can't stand Pizza Hut pizza. Yeah. That's what it's this tastes like. That. that pan Damn pizza. right. It's like, you know what? He might be on to something right now. And it's and and it tastes like that pan pizza. Um, the ingredients might be a little better. The cheese is good because you know the sauce looks a little homemade. It's a little oranger. The sauce is the sauce is okay. Like I said overall, it's it. If like I said, this is a if you like this is an eight dollar pizza. Cause yeah, if you like this, this style like pizza, pizza and this style pizza is what you dig, this is a great piece of pizza for you. For our liking. I, I'm gonna say our liking because when we do mm -mm. like pizza together, it's mm -mm. it's phenomenal pizza. But this is it just tastes like butter. Bam! It's just that the, after a couple crunches in the layer of the crust, it gets a little soggy. It just tastes like butter. Yeah, it's soggy. Mm -hmm. I mean, look at that. I know they you can't, can't see, see it, it, but they my can't my, see my it. hands are so greasy right now. Yo, this shit, this shit, this is upsetting. Mm -hmm. Is what I'm gonna we say. We drove 15 minutes about for this. Yeah, it's two. Yeah, mm -hmm. we're not going trash because some people might like it. Based on ambiance, the place looked cool. It looked like it wasn't really a pizza. It wasn't even a mm. pizzeria. It's like mm -hmm. an Italian mm -hmm. spot. They just so had to have pizza. But they advertised pizza on the door. And I've been hearing a lot of things about Matthews. And that, that's why I said on, on different judgments, mm -mm. this might be an eight pizza to somebody else. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. This is it's better than Pizza Hut. I'm going to tell you that. Cause there's no way I would have ate two slices of pizza at pizza. Oh, cause it's fresher. You can tell it's a lot fresher. And yeah. Those, the those probably rolled and the cheeses probably rolled every in every day. I just would prefer eat the same sauces on a hand tossed pie. Yeah, if I known this was deep dish, we might yeah. have went somewhere else. Yeah, we we wasn't for real. Not a big fan. No. So what you gave it? Five point five. I ain't even gonna make it that difficult. On a scale of one to ten. I feel like we do this like like back when you was in grade school. 70s to C, 80s to B, 90s to A. Anything below that is fucking failing. This right here, for me, would be in the same range as my man Mike. This is a five. I'm not even gonna give it a point five because it's not close to a six. No, I gave it the, the extra five points on the back end. Cause my man said the ambiance and shit inside was cool. That's why I get when I, I'm big on that kind of stuff. He'll tell you that. But again, I'm biased because I don't like Pizza Hut pizza. I don't either. I will I, I will not sacrifice eating Pizza Hut I, just because they got stuffed crust. I do not like pan pizza. All you, you know, taste is butter. That's all you taste. It's so, like no. With Brandon's score, with my score, they get a five overall. Not great. Not nothing I'm gonna stop and make a special trip for. Mm -mm. I don't think I was he never is. going back here again. I mean, he he probably lives closer than I do to this place. And I go to Man, never mind. I won't drop that. This yeah. is pizza, guys. But anywho, I wouldn't. I, it's not their fault. But I'm not mad at anybody. But I would never come back and eat this pizza. Yeah, I'm saying. not impressed. I get a little bit too animated sometimes. Um, He's right. I mean, a lot of people talk about this pizza. You hear about Matthews a lot around Baltimore. Um, not for $13. Like I said, for $13, no. $8, maybe $7, yeah. Um, a DiGiorno is more enjoyable than this. And it has to be your kind of pizza to come get this. I mean, oh, this ain't nobody one, one, kind of one, pizza. One more look at this. I want you guys to see. I mean, it's not spectacular looking. And that's that throws let's, you let's, off. Let's move the camera. Look, I mean, let's even move. right there, look, I got okay. it. It, it's just it's it's not spectacular. Can't even see the grease on it. Oh, you can see that it's drip right there. Look at it run down the plate. Mm. It's just you know, and sometimes I don't even fault the grease because grease sometimes can be wrong. Yeah, but this you have it there. This is a five. 
sorry, Matthews. I'm sorry to crush your dreams, your hopes, whatever you wanted us to give you, but you got an average slice of pizza in Baltimore. That's just below <laughs> average. This is below average. I've liked a couple other places better. This is below average. So, um, we ain't gonna wait three months to put out the next video. No, just coming out um, today. Just live. Just my know. baby girl came a little yeah. earlier than expected. Yes, that's why we've been so behind, man. Brandon's this goddaughter. This episode dedicated to Peyton Rose, man. Shout you out know, to young so, Peyton. Girl. Um, big ups to everybody that watches this. Like, subscribe. Damn. Um, Tell your people about us. You know, yeah. We out here in these Baltimorean streets. Check the pizza guys out. We're back with another episode. If you got any suggestions, drop them in the comments. There that you we go. take all suggestions. Yeah. Yo. You got a pizza spot that's good? In Baltimore. I'm not trying to go out to West Bumblefuck County. To be I'm honest sorry, with West, you. I can't cuss To be honest me. with you. Can't you know, me. we can we can make a oh, special request. Video, though. We can make a special request every once in a while outside of uh, of a strict area. We, we're trying to stay maintained in Baltimore area right now. But, I mean, I think we can make a day trip, if, if possible, if it's a really, really good okay, okay. pizza pizza, okay. and you're going to like and subscribe and hook us up with your like and subscribe and watch the video, we'll make the trip. Okay, Drop okay. it in the link. I, 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 I'll, I'll make a sacrifice for that. No, 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 no. Um, He's putting it on the thing. But we're trying to give you the best of Baltimore right now. Right. That That's the key. We want to put Baltimore back on I the map. I can't eat no more of this. You know, I'm not going after one pizza. At the one piece though, I'm good. Okay. Um, so there you have it. Five from the pizza guys. We'll see y'all in the next video. Mm.